Hey guys, good morning. I'm gonna bring you guys up here. <clears throat> Try to finagle you a little bit, guys. Okay. Hopefully this doesn't sit too weird. <coughs> Excuse me. So guys, as you can hear, the reason why I've been absent for longer than I wanted to is because I've gotten sick. Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry that I haven't been posting, but I've been trying to, I'm getting over this cold right now. So I do apologize. I'm going to fix me something to eat to take to work today. I still got to go in. I'm going to wear a mask today. Um, I'm going to go in and at least let my employer know that I'm not faking. I am really sick. <laughs> they trip me out because they always think that you're faking. And as you can hear by my voice, I've been coughing so much. I've pretty much lost my voice. But I'm going to fix me some lunch in case... They just use me as a standby or take less calls or whatever. I'm on the phones. And it's, today is Sunday. The good thing about it is that today is Sunday. <clears throat> so it's not a lot of people there. And on my road where I sit, I think it's only one one person on one side of me and then in the back of me on the way over. So I don't have to... um worry about anybody up close on me but i'm gonna wear a mask anyway i just feel better um doing that for everybody else's sake but yeah guys things have been a little bit crazy uh, um i know i put a post um a little memo out for you guys to let you know something happened um friday hold on guys So, yeah, guys, as you can see, I'm just in my little house thingy. But I actually just woke up from this morning. I didn't go to church. I just wanted to rest. I didn't sleep at all last night. I um I was up to this morning, about 7, 8 o'clock this morning. I finally came downstairs, got in the lounge chair and just laid back and actually fell asleep so i don't know what's up with that i don't know if it's because of my breathing um but i was able to get some sleep i'm just getting up real good so i say let me give you guys a shout out let me say hello let me let you see my face i'm so sorry but just to give you a quick overview of what happened friday so we have another business that um we started up and we have a post, we have a mail, I postal a uh, mail room or whatever. And we went to go pick up our mail. And the young lady who takes care of that, who gives us our mail, she wasn't there. Only my husband could pick up the mail. Um, we're still working on me being able to pick it up. We don't know what's going on with that. But he, his name is primarily on it, so he has to pick it up. So, anyway, like I said, we're working on that. We went down to pick up the mail. There was some chaos because she was not there when we got there. And he called her to say, hey, you know, where are you? Um, You know, we're here to pick up our mail. And she was like, oh, I'm on my lunch break right now. I don't see you guys scheduled to pick up your mail. So we was like, okay, all right, so you're not here. Okay, we're just going to go. Well, as we're leaving, as we're leaving, now she couldn't have been too far because by the, from the time we came out of the office and went down, came down the stairs and got in the car, which was parked right up against the building, she was pulling in and she was blowing a horn. And we was like, what's going on? So... We get there and her and my husband goes, no, not my husband, but she gets out of the car and say, hey, I, I got off my lunch break. So I came off my lunch break early so that I can 
um, give you guys your mail. I'm just going to give you guys a quick synopsis. I'm not going to go through every single thing. But um, my husband was not feeling well. So he had a straight attitude, guys. Honestly, he had a straight attitude. It shouldn't have ex escalated the way it did, but it, it escalated real bad. Um, she was just very unprofessional. My husband didn't help any because of his attitude. So, um, she made the statement that she got off her lunch to come give us our meal. And he was like, no, we're for the go. And she was like, no, you about to come up here and get this meal because I done came off my lunch break to give you y'all meal. And he goes, as you should have. And she was like, no, I didn't have to. What are you talking about? And... Guys, it escalated. He got out of the car. He's all in this lady's face. And one thing led to another. He told her, to, she told him to come on upstairs and get his mail. And she didn't want to fool with us no more because, um, because of his attitude, this, that, and the other. So they get upstairs. I, I go up there with him. He's like only dealing with her he doesn't want to want me to tell him anything like i said he had a straight attitude with everybody at this point he was not feeling good he he had an attitude um the the, the i'm trying to help him up the stairs he pushing me away telling me not to help him up the stairs so mind you our um our housekeeper our um his CNA or whatever she is, his helper, comes by on Wednesdays and Fridays and she usually just takes us or clean. She either cleans or she takes us where we need to go for the day. So she's taking him to go get this meal. I'm going with her because I had to go pick up some medicine. Because he shushed me away and told me he didn't want to, you know, he ain't want me to help him. He got out too. He pushing me away. I said, okay, I'm not doing this. I'm, I'm not feeling good either. So I don't want, I go get in the car and tell her, take, please go handle that. Go, go do that. Go handle him. So she goes and she goes up, she takes, she helps him upstairs. They go in, inside and they're fussing. Him and the lady, they fussing. One thing led to another, guys. Next thing I know, Tay's running out of the building. She goes, I'm not dealing with this. This lady done pulled the gun out on him. What? She done pulled, she done pulled the pew pew. What the world? Okay. How the heck? What the heck? So, I go up. I, I, She's telling me what's going on upstairs. I'm not going up there. I, I'm being honest. I'm not going up there in that, that situation. I'm not going to put myself in harm's way and don't know what happened while I was in the car. I call his mom um, and tell her, hey, you need to come and get my, get bam. Come get your son because he's not listening to anybody. He done got into a fight with this lady. This lady done did this, that, and the other. And he's going to cause herself to get harmed. And she, I said, can you just meet us at the house? Because if I get him to the house, then I can get him there. You can get there and calm him down because he's not listening to anybody. He'll listen to you. She said, okay, I'm doing something right now. As soon as I finish, I'll, I'll go. Okay. When I say this escalated so bad, guys, police was called. It was so crazy. But in the end he did realize that he was in the wrong both of them were in the wrong it escalated unnecessarily because neither one of them controlled their tempers she was cussing and carrying on talking about what he should have did and what she shouldn't have did and this that and the other and yada 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 and it was just bad guys so i've been dealing with that since friday and um, me getting sick didn't help anything. I worked yesterday. Um, yesterday was Saturday. I worked Saturday from 5 to 10.30. Yeah, I worked yesterday from 5 to 10.30 to try to make up some hours from the time I had. Um, they sent us home early from the storm. 
we don't get paid for those. So I need to make up those hours, guys. I need my money. That's the only reason I'm going into work today. Today is the end of the work period, the work week, um, pay week. So because of that, I'm going to go ahead on in today and I'm going to take medicine. I'm going to be down in my Robitussin today and my vitamin C and my emergency and all of that good stuff. Um, everything to try to in my antibiotics, everything to try to keep me going until the end of the night. So yeah, guys, one, like I said, it's just been a roller coaster of a day. Um, I just wanted to hop on here and let you guys know I haven't forgotten about you. I appreciate you riding with me. Thank you for what, um, my new subscribers. Thank you for um, all of you that has been watching the previous videos. You know, I'm trying to grow my channel, guys, so I will be on here more often and doing different, excuse me, more things. And, oh, guys, let me show you my cute little pot. It's a glass pot. It's, it. I cooked grits in it yesterday. It's actually glass or whatever thing this is. But it's so cute. It's so little. And it's so cute. It cooked, We cooked grits in it yesterday. So I just thought I'd show that to you since it was right there in my face. So I'm about to get ready for work, guys. I'm going to go ahead and fix two PB&Js. Just something to nibble. Sorry about that. My alarm came on. Um, Just something for me to nibble on at my desk. So, yeah, guys, um, I'll see how work progresses. I'll take you guys along with me today to let you know how today goes, let you know how I'm feeling throughout the day. And anything that comes up, I'll let you guys know about. I hit him up. That's dear coffee. He's getting over heels, though, but now I'm down. I'm, I have to seclude myself from him, so I won't get him sicker than what he already is. So, anyway, guys, I appreciate your time. I'll talk to you guys later. All right. Hey, guys. I just wanted to say I'm here at work. I did make it to work today. And it's my cough. <clears throat> Everything is a lot better. I'm outside right now getting some... Um, what do you call it? Getting some vitamin D in me. Um, I hope you guys can hear me okay. Um, I'm out here beside the building and it's a little loud out here. Um, and I don't have my microphone on me, but I just wanted to check in with you guys and let you know I did make it to work. I feel a whole lot better. I'm feeling better by the minute. Um, I was I'm gonna probably keep you guys um, updated with how things are going along today. The calls are going good inside of the um, the center here is uh, calls are slow so that's that makes it easy for me so anyway guys I'm gonna call you back on my lunch break at 6 30 and uh, let you know how I'm progressing at work talk to you soon okay guys hey how are you uh, good evening good evening good evening so guys, it's um, later this evening. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm back. I'm, I just made it home from work. It's a little after eleven, and I am ready to put it in. I actually got. Um, I got home, and my husband had already started the food. So I'm gonna show you guys that I'm cooking some white rice. Let me show you guys. I'm cooking some white rice. So yeah, in my pot on the stove. Yeah, we're doing that. So it just smells like it's burning.
to switch this over, guys. That did not turn out well in that pot. So I'm going to um, switch it out. Hold on. Put it in another pot real quick. I think it was too high. That's all. Hold on, guys. That, that was an epic fail, guys. This pot is very sensitive to heat. So, I'm going to put that over there and let that do what it's doing. Just put a top on here, put it on low, let it finish steam cooking. It already did the first boil. So I'm just going to go ahead and finish up this rice. Um, when the rice gets done, I'll, um, I'll I'll show you guys the final plating because I really don't feel good, guys. I'm not going to even lie. You know, when, when you're sick and at night, for some reason, uh, my chest feels like it's about to cave in. Um... At night, it seems like things just get triple, triple worse. So, I'm going to hurry up and finish cooking and so I can go lay it down. But, I'm going to try to get this video up for you guys for first thing tomorrow. If I don't get a chance to get it up tonight. I love you guys. If I don't get a chance to um, come back on here, I would definitely show you the after, uh, the after plating. Oh, you know what? Hold on, guys. Let me do this for you let me do this for y'all. Hold on. So I'm going to bring you guys and let you see the turkey wings. Oops. Sorry, guys. So, yeah. That's the turkey wings. I hope it's not fogging up. But, yeah. So, yeah, guys. Um... Let me get myself together because I, I literally came straight in and came straight into the house. So let me get myself together and I'm going to plate this up once every, once this rice cooks. I'm going to steam some broccoli and I'm going to plate it up and I'll let you guys see the final result. I love you guys to pieces. Talk to you later.